It's really significant that in John chapter 6, verse 66, where there's the first disaffection mm -hmm. uh, of disciples, and the word, right, it's translated into King James, they walked no more with him, right? And the word that is used there is apostasis, right? Which, from which we get the word apostasy. Mm -hmm. So what I want to say is that we are being instructed in New Testament language and stories that discipleship is personal and that it's one-on-one -on -one and it's about walking with Christ. Uh, Marcello D'Ambrosio is a great Catholic scholar who writes about the early church and he points out something really quite striking. He says, you know, in the age of martyrdom, right, the first Christian centuries, you just, you, you contemplate the horrific deaths mm. that some of these Christians were willing to undergo. And he says, they didn't sacrifice their lives for a set of ideas. They sacrificed their lives for a person. Those are beautiful words to think about because from this experience, you know, we have you know, James and John uh, who are also there and when they bring in all the, the, the fish and their ships, they forsake all and follow him. Yeah. I'm willing to forsake a few things, you know, I'll forsake a few hours 10%. here and there, <laughs> 10%, you know, maybe an afternoon or, you know, for the church. And, and I, I love how you made that differentiation. They're, they're not forsaking everything for the church. They're forsaking everything for Jesus Christ. And that, that really does change our outlook on, on how we serve and how we follow this idea that they're, they're giving up everything to follow him. Um, by the way, isn't it interesting the timing of the call? In my mind, it would have made a lot more sense for Jesus to go up to those four fishermen at the beginning of that experience when they're on the shore cleaning their nets kind of frustrated because they didn't catch anything working all night long and they're say a little frustrated with this profession <laughs> let me give you something more fruitful I'll, I'll i'll make you fishers of men that would have been the best time to call them when they're discouraged he waited until they had literally two boats filled with fish probably the greatest catch in the history of galilee he they could have become the president of that fishermen's association you've heard <laughs> people say and yet it was then when they had all of this opportunity that then he calls them. Now they have something to sacrifice. Now they have something to walk away wow. from.